What is going on YouTube? Fascinating graveyard. Today, we are at the Bohemian National Cemetery here in Chicago, Illinois. I've never been to the cemetery, but I'm glad I came. Today, we're here to visit the grave of Helen Sclair, uh, who was referred to in her life as the cemetery lady. Now, originally, uh, Helen was a school teacher here in the Chicago land area, somewhere around here. And after her second husband died and she retired, uh, she got bored. And I'm imagining that Helen always had a love and a fascination for graveyards and cemeteries such as myself. And she did tremendously. Uh, she was very vital in the record keeping process at the Lincoln Park, which used to be the Chicago City Cemetery. Uh, they had moved everybody that was buried at that cemetery, but one person, there's one uh, crypt there still left. Uh, I don't know if it was because it was probably too heavy to move. Uh, but through her uh, painstaking uh, process of just going through records and records, and by the way, there was no Ancestry.com. You know, there was no Newspapers.com. She did everything by hand. Uh, she discovered that there was actually quite a bit more graves uh, buried uh, in that uh, area right there. Uh, she was a collector. Uh self-taught historian i mean she was the go-to when it came to uh looking up any and everything when it comes to uh history here in chicago and chicago let me tell you has a lot of history she actually also lived in this very cemetery too she lived in the little house uh that i guess they would have the uh overseer of the cemetery uh, somebody went up to her and said hey how would you like to rent the little cottage on the grounds here at the cemetery and she says oh why not and uh, that is where she lived uh, for like the last uh, eight or nine years of her life and uh, she was on the local news here I watched her video on YouTube I want to say about three years ago and I always kept reminding myself, man, you got to come out here one day and just to visit her grave. And only uh, if she had started a YouTube channel, but I guess uh, she wasn't hip on uh, game when it comes to social media. Old school lady did everything by the book. And uh, even though somebody would, people would describe her uh, character as um, kind of like mine, straightforward. Um, she was always available to uh, sit down and speak with a uh, very intelligent woman and just uh, had a great love and fascination for cemeteries. She wasn't into like ghost stuff or hauntings, none of that stuff. She wasn't into that. She was simply into the history of cemeteries, uh, the people in the cemeteries and uh, pretty much that uh, part of everything. And uh, she lived in the cemetery, and uh, she, she died back in 2009, and they placed her where she lived, right here in this very cemetery, and this is her marker, and uh, Helen Sclair, the cemetery lady, look at that, an advocate for the dead, her cremated remains are buried right here. I wish I knew more about who she was so I could do a proper video, but um, I guess she was a woman of very few words. I mean, other than if you were talking to her about cemeteries, then she could probably go all day long. But uh, as a person that's visited cemeteries since I was a little kid, and you know, when I read her story online and I remember watching her YouTube video, I said, wow, I said, I like really wanted to meet that lady. And then when I looked her up, I found out that she had, you know, been dead for, you know, years. Uh, so I wish I had got the chance to meet her. Because, uh, you know, I, I would always be open to uh, meeting uh, people uh, who love cemeteries such as myself. Well, almost everybody. Not everybody. Some people. 
Anyways, a uh, a true historian. Some people say on YouTube they're historians. They're not historians. They're not really historians. This lady, before the internet, was a true historian. So rest in peace to Miss Sclair, the cemetery lady. Okay, guys, we are out of here. We are going on to the next video. I will catch up with you later, guys. Have a good one. Peace out.